Tell me about Beasley. I mean, you're, you're, uh, it, it's a modern day take on Beauty and the Beast, yeah? Pretty gruesome, huh? I've seen worse. Yes, it's very exciting, you know. I, I've always loved the story, and we're taking it and we're bringing it into a younger audience and showing them the new story as more modern and a little bit edgier, and it's a really great love story, so I'm hoping that they're gonna like it. Good chance Vanessa will get her wish, as a whole new generation should love this updated classic, which stars teen icon Vanessa, now 21, and this 19-year-old British stud of a model, Alex Pettifer. And you're the beast. No. I am the beast. For the first time I, that I've ever seen or witnessed, it's told through a male's uh, perspective. To become the beast, Alex had to sit still for an excruciatingly long period of time. Seven and a half hours of makeup? Yeah, it was like four and a half hours in the morning and like an hour and a half to get off. Yeah. That's a lot. I think I took a long time. Oh my gosh. Yeah. <laughs> right after I met up with Vanessa and Alex, I presented each of them the Show West Stars of Tomorrow Award, and Vanessa was suffering slightly from stage fright. How are you speaking in front of people? I mean, good, it's just the... I think I'm, I don't know. The idea of it just freaks me out, honestly. Alex was nothing but excited for the award, but admitted that outside a few smaller films, most notably 2006's Alex Ryder, Operation Stormbreaker, he's still new to big time Hollywood and all the attention coming his way. This is a big moment for you. I mean, here in the States, you're unrecognizable mostly at this point, but that will change. Are you ready for that? Let's uh, see if you give him any advice. Not yet. <laughs> I'm just going to grow a beard and some hair and wear a hood and hide, but no, I, I, I don't think you can prepare for, for anything that comes your way. There's no way to prepare a person yeah, for it. You just exactly gotta say, get ready. I learned my lesson. You've learned nothing. Adding further young clout to Beasley is someone who needs no schooling on media attention, Mary Kate Olsen, who plays the modern take on the evil witch. I only came to give you a second chance. Yes, I blew it. It was a whole world of characters and storyline and visuals and everything. Sort of beastly. I thought I'd take the ugly and turn it into something not. Neil Patrick Harris plays one of the few characters who understands the beast due to his own impairment. I play the blind tutor that's hired to teach him while he's sort of hidden away. And so I'm blind because I can't see his deformities and I sort of teach him the ways of uh, the world. Tough playing blind? Exciting playing blind. I, I chose to wear contact lenses that completely blocked out my vision completely. So oh. when I had them in, I, I really physically couldn't see anything. First right. we're going to do the sexy face. Now back to Vanessa, Alex, and me, wedged in there somewhere. I couldn't let the film stars leave before snapping a few pictures where I tried out my best icy, hot photo shoot pose. It's terrible, I know. Oh, your blue steel is unbelievable. I'm so bad. Look at your steel, it's fantastic. 